But, yeah. but what shifted, in your opinion, when the Problem Solvers Caucus had a much larger bill a few months ago, you did not like that piece of yeah. legislation? What, what, is it? What, what has shifted now when they're on board with this piece that's come out of the South? Perhaps you missed what I said earlier. Joe Biden committed to ending and crushing the virus and having a Build a Better America uh, initiative, Big Back Better, a vaccine answer to our prayers, an answer to our prayers of 95% effectiveness in terms of Pfizer and Moderna, and there may be others uh, coming forward. Now that makes, that is a total game changer, a new president and a vaccine. So th there's nothing to, th these are different, what, what was then before was not more of this. This is, has simplicity. It's what we've had in our bills. It's for a shorter period of time, but that's okay now because we have a new president, a president who recognizes that we need to depend on science to stop the virus, a president who understands that America's working families need to have money in their pockets in a way that takes them into the future without any of the contraptions of any of the other bills uh, that the administration was associating itself with them before. We feel very excited about the prospect that the, there's a bipartisan bill, because I told members, I'm not bringing any more bills that are not bipartisan. We wanted to, to, to um, show what needs to be done in the interest of negotiation. They're negotiating, it's a good product, it's not everything we want. Don't get me wrong. I, I don't want the Republicans to think that, we, uh, that this is a dream come true. It is not. But it is a path forward. Yeah. Well, you have to accept half of a loaf months ago. When you said, I'm not going to accept half a loaf. Look, I'm going to tell you something. Now, don't don't characterize what we did before as a mistake, as a preface to your question, if you want an answer. That was not a mistake. It was a decision. And it has taken us to a place where we can do the right thing without other, shall we say, considerations in the legislation that we don't want. Now, that is it. Now, th the fact is, I'm very proud of where we are. My chairs, my chairs have worked very hard on all of this. They were not even happy with a, a proposal that we made the other day before we saw this proposal. They thought we had come back to too small. So it's not about an individual, it's about how we address the needs of the American people. And we have to do it in a scientific way, and we have to do it in a way that recognizes people need food on the table. They need to get their rent paid. They need money in their pockets. They need their unemployment insurance to be there. They do not need a whole cacophony of other things that are on the agenda that have nothing to do with meeting their needs. So we're very pleased at where it is. And as I say, with a Democratic president committed to a scientific solution for this, with the idea that we will have a vaccine, it's a complete game changer from them. If you don't stand for something, you'll fall for anything.